Hello, my name is Joel Lababa, and I'm the Franchise King. We are going through all 10 commandments of franchise research. It is so important that you do amazing franchise research. It's really going to help you get where you want to go. Because if you don't do research the right way, if you don't research that $150,000, $200,000 franchise opportunity that you're thinking of investing in, it's just, it's just going to be ugly. So make sure you know how to do franchise research the right way. That's what I teach. And that's part of the 10 commandments of franchise research. I'm going through all 10 and we are at the end of the 10 commandments of franchise research. This is commandment number 10. Here it is. Do not visit franchise headquarters. What? All right, let me finish that sentence. Do not visit franchise headquarters of the franchise opportunity you're interested in until you are just about ready to say yes on that opportunity. A lot of franchisors these days try to get you to franchise headquarters really early in the game. I'm talking within a couple weeks after you contact them for information. It's too fast. Now, franchisors like doing this for one reason and one reason only. They want to get you excited about their opportunity. They want you to kind of get to know them in person and see how exciting the opportunity is. It's really a great way for franchisors to showcase what they're offering. And that's fine. But know that it's part of a sales process because they figure if they can get you to franchise headquarters early, they can get you really excited and you might make a move faster than you normally would. Here's what I want you to do. I want you to learn the business model in and out. I want you to talk to a lot of existing franchise owners. I want you to read articles about the franchise opportunity you're interested in. That way, you know what you're in for. Then arrange a visit. To franchise headquarters because really franchise headquarters a visit is to help you reinforce what you've learned in other words do you think that they're going to walk the walk you know some franchisors are really good at selling franchises and are really good at getting you excited about the opportunity but then after they sell it eh, they kind of uh, disappear a little bit uh, you want them there all the time you want them there before they sell you the franchise and after they sell you the franchise. Now, most franchisors are really, really good at selling franchises and supporting franchisees. But the only way to find out is for you to talk to franchisees that are, that are working the business and then visiting headquarters in that order. Don't do it too early. Make sure you are about 90% of the way there in your head that you are going to buy the franchise, all right, before you go to headquarters. Because after your headquarters visit, it's going to be decision time. And that's when you're probably going to be sitting down with your franchise attorney. You better use one. <laughs> Don't use a, a regular attorney. Use a franchise attorney. And that's when you're going to be making your yes decision. Usually a week or two after a headquarters visit. So, again, do not visit franchise headquarters until you are ready. Until you know enough about the franchise opportunity. And, and, and after you've talked to 10 or 15 franchisees to make sure that you know what you're getting into. I am the Franchise King, Joel Lababa. You will see the link below to all 10 commandments of franchise research. Thanks for watching.